What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing Pirates vs. Redcoats as requested. This battle is going to be a series of three battles actually. We're going to start off with the smallest one. These are the pirates we're going to be using today. This is a sword pirate, and then this kind of pirate just has a gun. These, um, British Redcoats, they have snipers. Um, I couldn't find a musket, so I had to settle for this. But, um, I think it looks alright. And then this is the British commander. He's going to be a little better than the Redcoats. Let's get started with battle. It looks like the Redcoats are winning. The pirates couldn't do enough. That's a red coat victory. Next round, there's going to be more units and different kinds of units. So I'll see you next round. Alright guys, welcome to round two. These are the new units for the pirates. He is the pirate captain. He has a pistol and he has a peg leg. This is the red coat brute. They have big axes. They're pretty strong. And there's a few red coats in the back along with a red coat commander. So that's going to be the battle for the second wave. And let's get into it. It looks like the brutes couldn't get to the front lines. There was too much crossfire. And a lot of the pirates are dying. But it's a pretty close fight. And it looks like the pirates took this one. So that's one point for the pirates and one point for the British. We'll see you in the third round, or tiebreaker. Alright guys, this is round three. The British have lots of soldiers, but this is their new soldier. It's a green trim British red coat. For this next battle, we're going to be introducing Edward Kenway. He has two knives representing hidden blades. He is the best unit on the battlefield, and he's going to help the pirates beat the Redcoats. This is Ed Wale, Edward Kenway's first mate. He is the second most powerful person on the ship, and um, he's the best swordsman on the ship. They also have bombers. They have pirate bombers. They do a lot of damage, and they're going to need them if they want to win against this big British army. So let's get into it. Whoa, yeah, those are big bombs. And it looks like the pirates won. So that was... That was a Pyrrhic victory for the pirates. They didn't really lose that many... They didn't really lose that many soldiers, but they destroyed the British ship. It's like they got attacked by cannons. I think this is a good spot to end the video, third round. And, um, I'll see you next time. Bye!